So we're very proud. You introduce him. All right, this, 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 this guy, boy. He, he's been doing stuff for quite some time here in Trinidad and Tobago in the hip hop circuit, the rap circuit, mm -hmm. of course. Uh, very, very talented, very witty, lyrics galore. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Chromatics is in the building. Yeah, yeah. Good morning to the entire Caribbean. Mm -hmm. This is boy Chromatics representing the Highway Records family in the building, DJ Pondera. Nice. You have a fast tongue, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, I like that. She's fast, she's fast. <laughs> Ladies, all rappers have fast tongues. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Just, you hear here in Trump. <laughs> and, and you understand everything. And I understood everything. Nice what talking about. Nice so, welcome, my brother. Thanks, thanks for having me here. Because we play everything, all genres of music here, once you're from the Caribbean. That's and you represent nice. strong. That's nice. right. Nice, thanks. Now, before we get into the actual song, which we premiered here on CSS two days ago, um, I know you know Stranger to Controversy mm -hmm. in terms of yeah, we like that. being pulled off of certain stations and yeah. fight down. And mm -hmm. So give it, give, give the cabin a break down. Yeah, your royalties. Give it a break down. Uh, well, you don't know is your boy Chromatics. I'm a hip hop artist based out of, of course, Trinidad and Tobago. Um, been doing it for quite some time. Have my own record company, Highway Records um, store, which sells strictly local music. The only local music store in Trinidad and Tobago, and also a recording studio. Um, and yeah, you know the, 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 the radio stations and the guys down here. You know, a lot of them support. Some of them don't support. Um, we've been in a lot of debates and fights. I won't say fights, but um, how to say it? protests and. Um, stances that we took against certain stations and certain vibes because of royalties and artists' rights and those those different sort of things and I, I felt the backlash a lot but you know we still here and we still strong because the streets you know mm -hmm. I'll be back all day so, and the people know. always talk yeah the people decide uh, even if they uh, they have the politics I mean I am one person that understands the politics with artists and radio <laughs> stations yeah, man, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and they fight on I have experience and yeah. blacklisting and, yeah. and, and sort of stuff. you know and I am one person <laughs> that uh, that feels that the, the reason we're not growing and our music not spreading is because of the constant fight down the, between the artists, the promoters, the radio stations, mm -hmm. you know, just keeping back the work of artists. Mm -hmm. So I, I feel your, your pain, but it, it's not something that will, will keep you down. You have to be a true artist to fight for what you believe in. And yeah. you look like a fella that you're standing up for what you believe in. Yeah, most definitely a long time now because I'm such a lover of music mm -hmm. that, um, I can't, I'm not going to take them kind of vibes, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? And I stand up and I represent me for all artists outside of the soccer realm, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. um, a lot of them are scared to make statements and do certain things, but that's all right. But that's what I love about you. The song have cojones. <laughs> <laughs> you have cojones. So what, what what made you do it for after Carnival? I know normally Carnival is your hibernation, so to speak, it, period. It's just the first time you've done a song like this, kind of wrapping up Carnival. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's the mm -hmm. first, what, first what, time. What, what made you do it? Yeah. Well, Jace, you know he's a hip-hop man. <laughs> yeah. So there's, there's, there was a rapper called Mad Skills. Mm -hmm. um, he used to do the year-round wrap-up every year. Okay. And he's an American-based rapper. And he used to basically wrap up what went on in the hip-hop industry. Right, right. Um, so I had a, a mind to do them. Uh, in the, around the middle of this carnival season, I was like, well, I'll do a little carnival wrap up. That would be cool. <laughs> you know what I mean? So throughout the season, I started, just Take lines, just lines started coming in my head. I'm taking notes a while, you know what I mean? Yeah, I wrote, I wrote the first verse carnival weekend, the weekend before carnival. Right. And then I was like, I was with DJ Pun. Uh, we was in the studio, chilling. And I was like, nah, I can't write the rest yet. I had to wait for Soka Mona to pass. <laughs> yeah. I had to wait for Monday morning and yeah. Tuesday to pass. Yeah. I had to wait for the thing to done. Right. Yeah. And then I go and write the rest. And I wrote the rest um, last week, Thursday. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, Pun was like, yo, let's let's do it. Because I was in two minds to do it. You know what I right. mean? Right. Why were you in two minds? Because I didn't... Um, I don't know. Because to be honest, the carnival is very... For artists like me, you, you, you're looking and you're searching and you're trying to find inspiration all around. Mm -hmm. And there's not much. Okay. So, aside from what was going on, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So, it's like, what am I to talk about? I have all these records that I'm trying to write and finish and 
you know what, I, I just feeling bad, so I started to get caught up in the carnival. I'm going all kind of feta and I mm. take every <laughs> night I'm this and I'm that. To get your vibes. Well, you no, it was just a release. Well, yeah, it's a release, basically, right. you know what I mean? And it kind of it kind of just helped me say, all right, well, yeah, let me do it. And, and when Pon Pon heard it, he's like, Dan, it's hip yeah. music. Yeah. You need yeah. to yeah. do that, you know? Let me ask you something. You know, being in the carnival and getting the carnival vibes, I mean, mm. you're Trinity to the bone. Do you ever think about making that transition from hip hop into the soca just for the carnival even? Oh, it had too much back on the hand. <laughs> well, I mean, you did it once, though, eh? When you, yeah. were, when you, when you were in the group spot rushes, you all did the, the Iron. We did Iron. I yeah. did the song with Justin Cross. I don't know if that was the first time you made me in the key. Oh, I had a okay. song with Justin Cross, yeah. which mm -hmm. was like a, a groovy right, crossover right. hip hop okay. style. Okay. Um, but, and if I were to do something, it would be along those lines. But let me tell you something. I would probably, before I enter Soka Monarch, I'll probably go in Calypso Monarch first. Yeah. Right. You know yeah. what I mean? I'll probably do something like that where the lyrics are Red, strong appreciated. Lyrics. Yes. yes. You know what yeah. I mean? That yeah. forum. I don't think, I can't write about nothing. Yeah. Right. I'm sorry, you know what I mean? So, um, so yeah. How much time do you go write about Han and White? <laughs> yeah, yeah, and Wave. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, who knows? I might be in the Bash Grand next year. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Yeah. Right? Yeah. We're not going to play this song yet because we're going to cross to news in about the next 60 seconds. After the news headlines, we'll come back, come back. and of course, talk about the song. Talk about the song some more and wrap it up before <laughs> 9 o'clock, right? So What's my, my brother's name? This is DJ Pun. DJ Pun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're up and So running. everyone knows the song by now because we've introduced the song last few days to the Caribbean. We've been explaining, keeping people on top, but you know, explaining my own. Not sure, you know, if they know. Not sure if they know everything. Yeah. So uh, they've really appreciated this song. Nice, nice. So let's talk about the song. The song. <laughs> Tell me, break, break down. I mean, you said you started it because the week before carnival, mm -hmm. and um, I mean, as let's say in a party, even the line with Jenny dancing in girls night out, and yeah, your boys say, "What are you doing here?" That yeah. was that actually took place. That well. The expression on his face said it all. Yeah, because like in the line I said, um, he watched me like this. My dad. Yes, yeah. I know the look. <laughs> you know the look. I know the look. I work there for years. <laughs> I work with him for years. I know the look. Yeah. I know the look. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, so. so that was the first line that catch me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> first line is the opening line of the song too. Yeah. I was hooked after the first line. <laughs> Yeah, what are you doing here, Jed? You do this my yeah, dance. Yeah, my dance, Jed. my dance. Yeah, yeah well, yeah. especially someone like me, if you know um, my past songs that have kind of targeted him on that mm -hmm. station. You mm -hmm. know what, I mean? what, 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 what's going on in terms of, do you know any reason why you're not getting played in certain stations? Is it a personal thing or is it because no, well, it's a copyright <clears throat> thing? Right now, just the song gone mad in China. Right. Everybody is playing it mm -hmm. except Except, um, <laughs> Except the two, the two nine sixes. Right, right, right. right? You know what I mean? But I got 99 problems with 9681. <laughs> yes, see? Right? But um, I have a royalty issue with one, and then the other one, his station, I have stopped giving them music since 2005. Mm -hmm. okay. So okay. Um, it's not a matter of they're not playing me or... So it's a personal thing. More or less. It was a personal thing between me and, and some people in the building. Right. Um, that, that it kind of went into the fact of Somebody took Hesse and changed it around and said, and like, yo, Matic saying this about you, whatever about you. And he reached back to the man. By the time he reached back to he, there's a different story. Okay. You know how the song rumors, right. and right. it basically right. it talks about that. Yeah. And by the time he reached back by he, I had a new song that was coming out. And, um, <laughs> and he's like, don't play that, don't play that. <laughs> so from the time it come like where, all right, you know him sure what this man said or whatever, even if I said something, don't stop my food, Jay. Because mm -hmm. I'm not stopping your food. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, this, mm -hmm. I try to do this mm -hmm. for a living. Mm -hmm. I, I, I'm doing this for a living now. Yeah. You know what I mean? But at that point, I was still trying to break out and, and do it professionally on a certain level. You know what I mean? So I was like, listen, it didn't need all the Jay. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Them other artists and them could come and give all the, all the power and kiss all the mm, mm -hmm. all they want. But I'm not going to do it. Mm -hmm. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Mm -hmm. None of this. I have, actually have real good friends who work in both of those stations, you know, who don't play the music. It's all good. Mm -hmm. you know, I have nothing personal against them. It's their management decide to make certain moves, so it's all good. You know what I mean? And it, as I say, it's on the streets, so we're in business here. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I once the streets, streets up the island, yes. we're in business. Once the streets embrace streets, it, yep. you're good to go. Yep, yep. I, I was glad you got the, the, the text yesterday, BB, yesterday when you told me 
uh, folks in Barbados heard it, loved it, yeah, man. and gave you love, so. Yeah. You know I, mean? I must say, shout, shout out to everybody in Barbados, shout out to my hip hop crews in Barbados, mm -hmm. Trey Z, Ruby yeah. Tech, mm -hmm. um, shout out to Inches, um, was tweeting about inches? it. Inches? Yeah, man. That's your name? I jiggle it, jiggle it. Oh, Inches. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> It yeah. have a number before the end. Let me your name is Angel. I want to know what is your first name. His name is Many. Oh, Many Inches. <laughs> More than Many Inches. All right, let's get straight into it, man. This is the Carnival 2K12 wrap up, the first of many to come. And this is going to be an annual thing, all right? Yes, sir. It's going to be an annual thing. So, this chromatics yeah. introducing again. Uh, before I say that, um, DJ Sham, Sham mm -hmm. from New York, mm -hmm. send his love for you. Yeah man, Sham, no doubt. Mm -hmm. um, send an email to hybridrecords at gmail.com, I'll shoot you that joint, you know what I mean? Same, nice, same nice, thing, nice, and then you wonder where you come second. Twice, twice. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, step to the mic just a little bit now, man. I, what, I mean, how, how you feel about the entire, the entire process of integrating with you? Well, being a super sailor, because I am. <laughs> when, I, when I first hear the tune, I was like, all right, Matix, this is hit music. This is what DJs love to play in parties, events, you know? Yeah, yeah. So one time I was like, yo, record, mix, master, and boom. Out oh, there. Love it. Mm -hmm. right. Right, what's next for you, Matix, for the balance today? I know your, your work ethic is just super hard, you grind hard. Mm -hmm. Um, what, what's, what's happening? I know you have some album you're working on and all that. Um, well, actually, the mixtape that the Carnival kind of wrap up is on mm -hmm. is going to be out. Hopefully next week, please God, it's going to be online for free. Mm. So anybody can go and download it. It will be on, um, site? It will be on my Facebook, Facebook fan page, right. Hyper Records fan page, um, which I'll plug just now. Right. Um, and then after that, um, I'll be releasing a song called Mr. Don't Care. Mr. Don't Care? Mr. Don't Care. All right. right. And then of course, look out for singers from the entire Hyper Records camp, John John, mm -hmm. Little Saint and Kane. And that's the really the focus this year is to take the the whole team, the whole camp on the next level because they, those fellas, they finished with their albums. Nice. Um, well, not fin nearly finished with their albums, and they have, I'm talking Jace, I really proud of the work. Real proud of the work that we put in. You know? Let me ask you something. How, how hard is it to be a hip hop artist in Ilana Soka? Well, well, it's very hard. It's very, very hard because you're fighting against what is the norm. Mm -hmm. You know, um, last year I, I went to New York for two months, which is the longest day I've had out there. And I understand now the difference. It's just the culture. You grow up in it and different. That's that's why a lot of my music, tell Gigi Cover. <laughs> that's why. <laughs> my honey. Honey, call back. I don't get the chromatics. Gigi, you know how much you Yeah. Yes, so, one time and two. Yeah, so. And he called back. Oh, and he called the chromatics. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so big your heart, my husband called back. Gosh. Um, you're saying you're going against the grade in terms of the, the culture, the yeah, culture, yeah. And the culture in New York. Yeah. So, so but what I realized is that, um, you know, all right, you have to do things to suit the market that you're in. Okay. So mm -hmm. songs like this is yes. for here yes. and, and for, yes. for the Caribbean. Yes. Yes. That's why the other songs that I'm going to be releasing are more all inclusive. Yeah. More all inclusive. Right. To, right. To, to, to a worldwide songs like Superficial that I have, songs like Cold Blooded with John John that I had um, a couple of years back. Those are songs that can relate to anybody right. worldwide. Right. Right. You know what I mean? Um, so those are the songs that I'm going to be putting out. So you have to kind of suit, suit suit your the market. product for the mm -hmm. market. You know? Well, we want you to know, CSS supporting you. That's right. We're here for you right through. Keep selling your music. We'll let the Caribbean here. I just got a comment from um, Trinbasia. She says, good morning. That song is super. Love it. Heard it on Monday for the first time. So true. Uh, what he's saying, I was there for Carnival. There you go. And it's so true what you said, even for the Trinis that may not appreciate hip hop music and see it as an outside thing, they can definitely relate mm. to this wrap up song because, as you say, it's targeted for this market. Yeah, that, yeah. So, maybe it's one way to make that kind of crossover mm. where everyone can appreciate it. And as Trinis, right of the islands, they really love in it. So we wish you all the best, my brother. Oh, you have a fan here. I am a fan. <laughs> I am a fan. And uh, thanks to Jace because, you know, because he's a hip-hop man. Yeah, and, and I'm he's supporting been, this man from day yeah, one. So he's day been one. introduced yeah. me to all the local hip-hop. Give him some first, history. <laughs> first man to ever pay me to perform 
How much you pay? Five dollars now, cause you nah, cheaper. Was... <laughs> <laughs> Six dollars. It was more than zero, which uh, is what exactly. I got up to that point. Exactly. So um, I appreciate that mm -hmm. so much. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Um, and I've supported me since day one. Mm -hmm. um, so thanks to James for everything. Respect, my boy. Um, I just want to before I go, shouts to everybody of the islands. Mm -hmm. um, I've performed in Barbados before. It was one of the best welcomes I've ever had of performing in Grenada already. So if y'all want me back, you know, just hit e e email highwayrecords at gmail.com. Everybody out there, log on to Facebook now. Mm -hmm. Facebook.com slash Matix T T M A T I C S T T. Twitter. I like the page. Twitter at Chromatix1. When you go to the page, you can actually see the video. There's an actual tab on my fan page. It says Carnival Wrap Up. Right. Click on that and you'll see it. Because you know I, mean? I, I saw it on YouTube. Yeah. I yeah. went looking for it and that's when I found it on YouTube. So I saw it last night. So mm -hmm. you could also hit it up there too. And uh, I love it. It makes me laugh. It makes me. Uh, anybody who is here for the carnival is the perfect name yeah, for the song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go plug it. Yeah, I'm going to plug it. But I ain't in it. <laughs> I, see, I, see. I think I hear off it. We had to do we all wrap up on that back and all in coming. That, that's yeah. that song by itself. Yeah. Larry Joseph gets soup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Yo, all big, right. Up, big up to the whole Highway Records family Lil St. John John, mm -hmm. uh, Kane, Cuban, DJ Punch, shout out Immortal Vibe, Song System of the Islands, you know what I mean? So. That's the love for having me here. Thanks, so Matic, thanks, for, thanks for coming. Thanks for coming you know, this is uh, it's just, just second home. Yeah, you, yeah, you're just going from place to place now, and we just wish you all the best. And again, this is your home. We support all artists here, straight across the board. And once you're from the Caribbean, we love you. Love it. All right. All right. That's what it is. CSS Caribbean Superstation. Your CSS. We're doing it live. 9:06 your time. Getting into the Mars versus Venus coming up next. Don't move. The Caribbean.